Hello, this is Casper David, and I've got a game of domination on Overflow. And this this game is uh, actually I didn't really think was gonna happen. And as you can see, I'm using the uh, uh, butt naked Chicom CQB because this is during the time I was working on the Chicom CQB with getting kills with no perks and attachments. And uh, as you can obviously tell, judging by just saying that I have no perks and attachments. This is like, I guess you can say, my second episode of what I like to call Perks and Attachments. Who needs them? <laughs> I guess you can say it's a little series that I'm doing on here. And uh, it's not something special like I did with the FAL video. I mean, because, uh, like I said, I was just using the Chicom uh, just to work on kills with no perks and attachments. And the uh, current score streaks I've got are UAV, Counter UAV, and Orbital VSAC. Cause and to be honest with you, I usually don't really do to, well, not super beast all the time with the Chai Com, because most of the time it can be kind of easy to miss with this gun. And I really apologize for the super lag that's going on. I must have been lagging pretty bad during this game, even though I'm, even though this was in theater mode when I was recording this at the time. So my apologies, but I do end up uh, another another good uh, upside to this uh, gameplay as I go 63 and 13, which is pretty dang good and what I really did not think that I was gonna do uh, especially with a butt naked chai com and uh, I do end up getting I, f I totally forgot how many VSATs I got but I do, I do believe I, do, I got double or triple VSATs in the game but I will put I will uh, 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 I will of course put, put the uh, thumbnail to make sure and stupid RCXD sorry I accidentally uh, put my finger up on the uh, uh, my, because I have a little bit of an itch going on right now, I probably need a more comfortable headset or need a better microphone that I can just speak into without having to use a headset all the time. But I'm using a uh, just a regular old Logitech headset. Um, I, I do need to get one of those, uh, I forgot what it was called, it's just those uh, microphones that you can just speak into and uh, not have to wear a headset all the time. It's it's that kind of uh, microphone. I just need a stock microphone so I can so I can have, provide better talking. You know what I mean. But uh, I'll probably get that sometime in the future. Excuse me, I still got that stupid itch going on. Man, this sometimes this headset can be kind of annoying. But uh, but yeah, I will uh, try to count how many VSATs I've gotten in this game. I've gotten at least two, somewhere between two and three. Which is again, I did not really expect I would I would get on here. And uh, in my opinion about the Chicom, uh, there are times when I like the Chicom and sometimes I don't like it. The thing I don't I, I do like is it's a uh, pretty pretty easy to use most of the time. And considering that it's a burst weapon, excuse me, I got more itch going on. I really apologize for all that. It's just that this itch is really annoying. And like I said, it's a, it's a burst weapon, and I am a big advocate when it comes to uh, burst weapons. But, I mean, unless you want to compare this to the, like, the SWAT or the uh, uh, M8A1. The, I just, I mean, the M8A1 is really good, but uh, the SWAT, it's just... I mean, sometimes whenever you feel like you're using like the uh, M16A4 or the FAMAS from uh, Modern Warfare 2 or the Type 95 or any one of those guns, it just it just doesn't really feel the same. Maybe they kind of buffed the uh, nerf the uh, uh, burst shot guns so that way they wouldn't be hardcore overpowered like they used to be in the previous Call of Duties, and uh, that's probably one of the downsides in terms of uh, burst burst weapons. But, uh, I mean, the, the sort of upside, I guess you can call the upside, is that, um, um, you can, uh, shoot the, uh, Chai Com where it can seem like it's, like it's automatic. And see, there's my first VSAT, but of course I don't use it since we're getting close to running out of time in this round. And, uh, but it, I mean, it's good, it's a good thing that you can just, uh, like spam the trigger and make it seem like it's, a uh, like it's a fully automatic gun. I mean, because sometimes I put select fire on this gun to make it make sure I don't miss my my shots most of the time. I mean, because depending on how you are with this gun, it can be pretty easy to miss most of the time. And uh, but there, it's just it's just a uh, good that you can. Uh, I mean, it's sort of somewhat accurate most of the time. And uh, 
I mean, like I said, I sometimes don't really do very well. Not all the time. So I guess you can say I was lucky to be in this lobby full of noobs. <laughs> but, um... Uh, um, another thing is the uh, iron sights can be kind of somewhat tough to use. I'm not saying they're, they're unusable. I mean, they can be usable, but sometimes I like to use a red dot just to make sure that my shots will count. Or sh my shots are hitting. And uh, that, that's just what I like to do. I like to make sure that my shots hit. Of course, I'm sure all of us do like having having to make sure our shots touch, or shots make contact. And here we go with some more of this lag. That's what happens when I've been experiencing bad lag um, recently. And and that's that's just what's been happening recently. I've been experiencing pretty bad lag, and I have no idea why. Maybe it's because they're. Uh, maybe it's because the. Uh, uh, connection in Texas just kind of sucks or or I don't know I mean I wish they would just uh, kind of improve on these connections but it looks like they're not gonna be doing that anytime soon and uh, I'm just gonna have to just gonna have to deal with it I mean like I've, I've been playing Modern Warfare 2 again and it, it just it's been I've been experiencing bad lag problems too so that was a big bad big bag duty duty fruity <laughs> Big bad loss right there. And there's my second VSAT. Well, now we know that's a double. I mean, I knew knew for a fact that I had at least double VSAT. But I just lost track and see if I got had double or triple. And there's a dark corner McDougal right there. I mean, that's what happens whenever you run into McDougals. It can be kind of... I mean, guys like that can be kind of tough to hit with his uh, chai con. And I uh, go on like a bit of a rampage here. I didn't think was going to happen. I mean, if I had maybe like a fast mag or quick draw handle or something like that maybe I would have been on like a more of a rampage with this I mean because I guess it just seems like if I do it with no perks and attachments it seems that luck is on my side most of the time at least and I have no idea how that came to be absolutely no idea but I guess that's just how it is I was a bit disappointed right there and I realized I only had three bullets left well that's what happens when you don't have scavenger I mean, I, I mean, of course, I would need to have scavenger so I can at least uh, know what to do and uh, keep my streak, my streak going, or not have to worry about finding another gun at least. And uh, this part was actually a little bit, a little bit tense because like there was like three guys right there, three or four guys on that same, same uh, little boathouse, that boathouse. That's, cause that's what it seems, a little boathouse. And uh, yeah, that. That's how theater is right there. It looks like, oh my god, you didn't even hit him. Well, that's what theater mode is right there. Sometimes it makes you kill kill enemies even though the bullets didn't even touch him. And as you can see, I got the uh, uh, um, challenges done where uh, you have to get kills with no perks or attachments. And miraculously, I was able to get the, the uh, bloodthirsties out of the way. I didn't really think I was going to get that many bloodthirsties in this game. Especially with the Chai Com. I guess I was... I guess I must have uh, really got involved with the game there. Just a lot of noobs. <laughs> but I guess I'm not sure if you can call that me. I was I was lucky to be in this lobby. But, I mean, at least I got the challenges done, so. And uh, since I got this mad Kate kills and death ratio, it was just, I just couldn't resist putting this up. So, may as well just add to the No Perks or Attachments series that I'm going here. <laughs> And I've gotten quite a couple of the uh, uh, levels gone up with this gun. I mean, I think I, I think I recently unlocked the quick draw handle. I and just now unlocked the uh, FMJ. But as of right now, I do have the Chicom done. I'm still working on the MSMC, but I recently prestige to a uh, um, prestige eight. So, oh laggy, laggy, laggy. There's a there's a McDougal again. <laughs> laggy, laggy, laggy. That's what happens. Lag really really messes you up. And uh, I have to wait until I totally forgot what level. Uh, I believe level 30 is when you un unlock the MSMC. I totally forgot what level it was, but somewhere around there. And sometimes the MS. I mean, I like the MSMC, but the MSMC can be kind of tough to use the iron sights and get uh, headshots with. It, that that's how it can be sometimes. I mean, I mean, I'm not saying the iron sights are are not usable. I mean, they're usable, but it can be kind of tricky to hit them uh, with the iron sights. That's why most of the time when I use it, I at least have a red dot sight on it. 
I mean, because because I like to uh, make sure that my shots count. And right there, I did not. I mean, yeah, I may have picked up the Remington, but I did not hold the X button to pick it up. I have no idea how this whole random pickup things came about in this game. Well, I guess it it came to be that I've only got a double V sat, and it just seems like I had a triple V sat for for a while here. But still, getting two V sats in a with a gun with no perks or attachments is still really really good. And I was kind of I was I was pretty proud of this gameplay. Like I said, it came out of nowhere, and the kills and deaths came out of nowhere. I mean, sure I lost, but I mean it's, it was just really epic gameplay. I just couldn't resist. But yeah, I, um, that's it for this video. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will keep up with this no perks or attachment series going on. And uh, as always, take it easy.